Hello there. Today I'm going to share one of my interview experience with Branch International Company for software engineer intern role. It is a great company to work for because they provide the remote workplace and uh, it is a product based company and hence I had also applied for the software engineer intern role through the referral of an employee of that company and uh, I got a phone call up just after the referral on the same day I got the phone call of an interviewer of that company and uh, he had taken my uh, phone interview and after that he had asked me the appropriate date for the next interview round if you talk about the interview round then that interview is taken by a third party company named as uh, i think uh, it is teamware teamware company so a different company is taking your interview not the employees of that branch international company remember this thing so that teamware company was taking my interview and they had scheduled my first interview round it uh, that first inter interview round is the technical round and the second interview round is the low level design and high level design now let's talk about the first technical round so in the first technical round let me tell you what she had asked first she will ask you uh, a specific programming question which would be slightly difficult but it is not that much difficult try to understand in that coder pad she had given me a question and i need to solve it in half an hour after that half an hour she has started asking questions related to the computer science operating system computer networks dbms all the core subjects like what is race condition deadlock sql versus no sql have you ever used an sql or not or no sql or not what is transaction in dbms triggers and everything about the web services how to create a web api what is an api and have you ever created an api or not and many things like that so you should have to prepared for all these things she will not be asking you that uh, create a bst or like these things because branch international is a company which is web, which is on the web application and android application so if you are applying for a software engineer intern role as well then there also they will be asking you the back end back end things or back end questions so you need to prepare for that after that let me tell you what question she had asked from me the question the programming question that she had asked uh, in the in the beginning of the first technical round was something like minesweeper have you have you ever heard about the minesweeper game she had not given me any question or any photo of that question she just directly introduced that have you ever uh, heard about the minesweeper game so i said yes and then she started explaining the problem statement to me there was no such type of image in front of me she was just telling me the text and i was understanding it so basically i am just giving you the visual representation of the thing that i understood from her that uh, there is an asterisk sign and just assume it as the bomb and this is the 2d error of strings and wherever there is a asterisk that is the bomb and wherever there is no asterisk there is not a bomb and you will have to create another 2d array of integers in which you will have to store the numbers 2d array of string was given to me and i have to generate the 2d array of integers and i will tell you that what i need to generate in the 2d array of or what numbers i need to store in 2d array of integer so you will have to identify the number of bombs present around each cell and have to assign that number of bombs in that cell for example if we talk about the zeroth rows zeroth index then three adjacent cells are there like uh, the zeroth rows first index and first row zeroth index and first rows first index these three are the cells which are adjacent to the zeroth rows zeroth index so hence you will have to calculate the number of bombs or asterisk in these indexes and as they are one only or it is one only so we will assign one in the 2d array of integers on zeroth rows zeroth index and i haven't count the bomb present on that index itself we just have to find the adjacent or number of bomb present in adjacent cells so this was the problem statement given to me and i have to create the algorithm for creating the 2d array of integers from the 2d array of string just after that she started the rapid fire of the uh, api and all such things like types of questions or back end services questions so you you need to be prepared for that because it is very important for you if you want to get selected then you need to get prepared so be ready for that because uh, in the first round you need to solve that question and you will have to answer at least half of the questions then only you can go up to the second round you don't need to worry about the questions of the second round or the low level high level design round because uh, if you will get selected in the first round then you will get a mail in that mail you will get the topics which would be asked in the high level and low level design or which are related to high level and low level design which would be asked in that interview so you do not need to worry about it i hope these things are clear 
and just after completing the second round or the second low level high level design round they will give you a hr link or link for the hr round in that hr round they will they will tell you everything about their company and uh, the salary structure so after that you do not need to worry about anything because you are selected and that's why they are telling you the salary structure and all such things before that also or uh, before the hr round they are asking you several managerial questions that how will you manage these things or if you are having a web application and uh, there are several several errors in that web application but you need to you need to deploy that web application so what will you do and many questions like that so you need to get prepared for that thing as well so after that after that hr round everything would be clear you do not need to do anything and uh, you are get selected when i had applied for this position so i was not having prior information that what would be asked from me so that's why i think it would be definitely be helpful for those who are giving this interview for the first time so i hope this would be helpful and leave a like for me if it is helpful thank you